The reason why drill rappers don't get paid after they die, because gang gang don't look out for drill rappers. That's the truth. A lot of drill rappers is not telling y'all the truth. Now, drill is, I guess, is entertaining. We can't lie about it. My kids are outside here, so y'all say what's up to everybody. That, that's some of my kids here. <laughs> I got more than this. Y'all say peace. Say we got a squad. We got a squad. We got a squad over here. Being that I got a squad, if something happens to me, I got to make sure that this squad is taken care of. A lot of these drill rappers got squads like me. You see these beautiful squads? And they can't take care of their squads after they die. That's what they don't tell you. A lot of these drill rappers get arrested for the head honcho rapper. A lot of these drill rappers, like you look at the Dirk situation and the King Von situation. I made two videos. I made a video talking about how um, Range Rover, King Von Uncle ain't cool with Dirk in them. I did another video explaining how when you die, people don't look out for your mama, just like L.A. Capone. His mom wasn't looked out for. You guys seen that. The mom never was protected as far as income, resource. She didn't get nothing for the death of her son. You know what I mean? Nah, y'all can keep talking. I'm not cursing. So these people in the video can't say anything. Y'all could chill. Y'all good. But at the end of the day, you see, I, I wanted to have my family around me to make this video so y'all can know I ain't clout chasing none of that. I want everybody to know this is the sermon going on, bro. When a rapper dies... The resource never goes back to their kids, their mom, brother, dad, nobody. When a rapper dies, people are selfish for selfish reasons. I'm looking at a lot of rappers that died. Young Pappy, when he died, I'm pretty sure Blue Da Vinci and all these people around him, they got his money the right way. But did some things through the cracks get slipped? I don't know. I want to hear from the family. You can keep naming drill rappers after drill rappers that lost their life. What did you gain from it to back you up? Do you have life insurance right now? Is the company that you're with guaranteeing you a better life if your downfall should happen? And honestly, don't don't hope these fans gonna keep you living and keep your kids entertained. They forget about you niggas when you die. When you guys die, they go to the next rapper. They go to the next rapper when you guys die. They don't, rem it's not consistent, bruh. It's not worth it. None of that is ever gonna be worth it. I see a butterfly that was coming to me. That's one of the one of the dead drill rappers' spirits letting me know I'm speaking on a mission right now. I'm letting them know the truth, bruh. None of you people care or what's do up, anything with. Who y'all saying what's up to? Yeah. To, the, to the vlog. The vlog? Oh, look at you, bro. When we go to the new house, give me five. Y'all seen the new house already, right? Y'all yeah. like the big house? Daddy. All right, hold on, Junior. You got to let me make this video a little, man, all right? Mommy, all right. Nah, nah, bro. Let me finish the video, and then you can do what you do. You can go. When we go to the new house, that's what we're going to see. And at the end of the day, man, the definition of what we see with rappers today. I'm, I'm talking to the kids and doing this video. Now... What happens to rappers, bruh, there is no new house. The way you hear me saying I'm going to a new house. There is no new vehicles for mom and them. There's no new nothing. And it's like all the guys around them, they're the ones who's eating after you die. Niggas don't, niggas don't remember you, but honestly, all gang members, bruh, and, and especially in the drill rap and all that, everybody just want to, babe, you got to go over there. I'm, on, I'm recording. Go stand right there. Talking to the wife right there at the end of the day bro rappers gotta look at the situation bro drill is drill i'm not talking about the killing part i'm talking about where's the loyalty bro there's no loyalty around there or anywhere moving from it hold on why did i do that junior yeah so why would you touch that yeah my son is a silly fuckers uh, Ruckus is not what you guys think it is. That means he gets in trouble a lot. But yeah, drill is drill even worth it? Like I like the drill music and all that. I ain't gonna be fake, but I'm talking about you guys who are in it. Is it worth it? I mean, look, look at all the dudes around y'all. Nobody looks out for nobody. Nobody does anything for anybody. It's just all everybody out for themselves and they get something for themselves. It's not really cool, bro. I don't know, man. With King Von dying the way he died, I got to definitely put this part. I'm going to add it to the video. And I, also, I, I just wanted people to see this. Hold on. What you said, King? 
King car? Yeah, King car. King car. King car. Someone want his own car. But I don't know, man. It, it is what it is, man. It's a lot of situation with this drill rap that I don't put my, I, I don't snap, snap my hand behind that, bro. It's so many fake things, bro. Like maybe, maybe that's why I'm bothered. When it's like now I can look past it, but like back, if it was 11 years ago when I looked at the drill movement or any gangs, even 20 years ago, 30 years ago, bro, you can at least say drill or any of the gang, gang, gang. You know what I'm saying? It was hypnotizing. You like seeing a whole lot of people together being family because we try to internalize what we're going through in real life with them. So we try to equate it to compare it and contrast. And it's not comparison, bro. It's like you got your glasses on now and all you see is this person's fake, that person's fake, this person like this nigga's gonna rob you, this nigga gonna backdoor you, this nigga gonna try your mama, this nigga gonna make sure your kids don't get your income and money, this nigga over here is gonna hop to your ops and become cool with your ops, this nigga's gonna sleep with your baby mama, this nigga gonna get your girl. It's like it's it's all fake, bruh. There's nothing real behind all this, so why we do it for? I wish one of these niggas told y'all the truth. We just trying to get my papers up, and then I'm going to get ghosts. That's what it is. Look at all the guys around you, gang. Everybody's just trying to get ghosts. I'm going to get what I can, and you ain't going to see me no more. I know I'm the one who's tweaking, right? But if you ask every rapper or every gang member to watch this video that I'm doing, you see my family, you see the energy, you see the vibes, and they're going to sit back and be like, they wish they could live a life like that too, where you just rock out with your folks in them. I just got my very first crib. I mean, I've been had houses, been had my house, but a house that I actually own. You know what I mean? Not paying rent, none of that. You know, I felt good. It's hard work, bro. Can you imagine if these dudes got anything like that? They'll change their lives, bro. If you're going to sign somebody off the streets or whatever, have a game plan and, and, and knowing the amount of goals and the years it's going to take to reach that goal. So when they're having their you know, life on the line or whatever. They got something they can at least obtain from that, bruh. They got something, some some type of property, something, bruh, some type of investment that brings others a uh, source of income, streams of income coming in for that person. So even after they dead, through on longevity, the family will still be taken care of because I don't want one of the guys to be like, I got your family for you when you die, dog. Don't worry, I got your kids. It sound nice. It sound nice. I want something on paper, gang. All that, oh, I'm going to look out for your kids. Your kids is mine. It sounds good, bro, but it don't work that way. It don't work, bro. All, all, with all the back doors and everything going on, you want me to believe these same individuals who can't even keep their life safe. Number one, let's pretend if they, if they will have my kids back. They will protect my loved ones and all that. What if you get dropped? Huh? What if you get dropped and you ain't here no more? What's going to happen? Who's going to take care of mine? Nah, nah, bro, it got to be on paperwork or I just don't want to be part of the gang, 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 bro. I, I want life to get trickled down in the best way for me and my families, bro. At the end of the day, all I see is some fluke shit. I don't see realness. I don't see what the energy is like. I see a lot of people who's picking and choosing and picking sides. And I see a lot of people not picking the number one side, which is your guys. How about do that first? Before you get to picking sides and all that, pick your guys' sides. Pick their mamas, their kids, everybody to look out for. And if you can't do that, then don't preach gang, gang, gang. I ain't mad at you. I can't take care of everybody. But put out the message out there. We can't look out for everybody. Then I can respect it more. But don't give me some Disney World show, some fake phony show. Y'all all part of the guys. Y'all all part of the clique. And y'all don't even got love for each other like that. Or if y'all got love, but y'all not really trying to look out for each other. Don't sell us a facade. Keep it stacked. Tell us what it is. Tell us what you engaged in. Tell us what you and thrive with. And if you do it like that, I can look at the situation and, and say, at least he ain't lied to y'all. He told you he full of cap. He told you he ain't gonna look out. He told you life ain't what it is and what you think it is. And this ain't really gang, gang, gang. Or it's gang, 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 but gang don't mean families. If, if the gang members can say that, I respect it. Gang don't mean family. And when we see they don't mean family, we can salute y'all and understand what it is. Hey, Junior, chill out with that, bro. If it don't mean family, it don't mean family. Leave it at that, bro. Don't give us a fake dream that we, we can't, you know, paint or see the picture in like that. Look, man, I'm your God bless one. Hit that notification bell. Share this video. Hit that like button. Make sure you like this video, bro. 
Look, man, I'm out, man. This is crazy, bro. Niggas losing their life for literally nothing and gaining nothing out of it and receiving nothing out of it. And your folks in them receive absolutely what? Nothing. Remember the song, War? What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Facts.